campers. Um, it's only going to be a really quick one tonight. I've had unexpected guests and the lady's been working on my blog for me and because I had it set terrible. No one could leave comments. I couldn't leave comments. It was just too overcomplicated and this lady's been and done it for me and she's a lifesaver. So thank you Catherine. That was absolutely amazing of you. Um, I did forget to show the desk tidies. I know I've been making the paper ones which I adore. These are fabulous. Um, I've got three along my desk because I literally have to have everything to hand. But the lady messaged me and said she wanted to see the one I used with the acetate boxes. Well, I'm just going to pop. These are um, stamping up demonstrator stamps. These are, but look, they're cracking. And the ones you get out of the boxes. Um, you can have them any size you want. You can add your dimensionals. Um, your cards. I cut my cards to two different lengths, three different lengths. And you could pop them in there for card fronts. Easy access, dimensionals. They're so easy to make. Um, I've got my other desk tied at the moment. And then this is on my shelf. But this is all my to hand stuff. Like I say, I can't go jumping around and grabbing things here, there and everywhere. So, um, this is on my shelf for my other bits. And it's just, us. I know it looks scruffy, but please don't. When we go and get stuff from Stampin' Up, some of them come with this really thick card. And some just come with plain, um, you know, white card. Not as thick, but this thicker stuff is fabulous to make the platform. It's so sturdy. Really good. So, I needed this to be cut down just. So what I do, I'll show you on the spare piece. That way you don't ruin any blades. Please don't go trying to cut this card. It's super uh, hard. But get to the size you want. Um, let's say four inches. And score it as deep as you can. And then it's so much easier. You can even snap it. See, it's so easy. But... Then I take my scissors and cut it to the size I want. Please don't use your blades. You will blunt them and they're, they're dear enough as it is. But score by all means. Your score tool is that's what it's there for. And then I just remove the score line then like I just did. Um, I normally do anyway. So let me try. Because if you try cutting it without, it's really stiff. But... Oh, gosh, see? Ugh. If you score it, then you can cut it easier. So that's that bit out of the way. So I just use this piece of 6x6, six six and I'm using a piece of designer series paper from the Bubble and Fizz. It is going to be a little bit over because I trimmed off the score line so it didn't leave any raggedy edges. So I just glue that down, and I'm going to have the bottle caps on mine. I think they're so cute. And then we're going to cut the boxes. Again, I use my, um, I do use my blade, but I don't do it on the thicker bits. I just do it on the inner bits. So let me get this glued down for you. And then I'm going to trim off the excess. But yeah, you can add glue on here, or just straight onto your board. Right to the edges. And I'm sorry for rushing. Like I say, it's nearly 10 o'clock at night now. Uh, my granddaughter's in the lounge. She will be going up to bed shortly. Snap. So will I. And a happy new year, everybody, by the way. Um, hope you all didn't get too tipsy last night. <laughs> we stayed in. Bless. So, I'm just going to add my paper. And I love the Tombow. Gives you wiggle space. And as I did, I was going to show this last night on my video and then totally forgot all about it at the end. But I thought, how can I come on and give the, these wonderful people something to watch tonight? So I thought, quick, make the desk tidy. And I haven't got long. I do apologise. I will. I've got a mini album for you tomorrow. Uh, we did it in June and a make and take at the um, my upline. Uh, organised a, a day in Birmingham and it was absolutely marvellous so we, I haven't put the ribbon on yet but uh, yeah it's one of those little mini albums 
you can add little photographs or captions and just write things and you can turn it over even and I've decorated the back so we're going to be and we're using the memories of more packs but I'm going to close this with a ribbon uh, tomorrow night I'll leave your other video but uh, yeah that's what we're doing tomorrow so basically this is mine don't worry about because once you've got things in there you cannot see that uh, the glue I use fast fuse by the way so what you're going to do is, you're going to decide how tall you want your boxes on here. The taller ones will hold, obviously, really tall things. You know, like your stamp sets. Um, you get a couple in there, actually. There's, well, you can get five cards and envelopes in each one of these slots. So you can imagine how much you can get on your desk tidy. Um, you could even add, if it's not too wide now, you could add your... Fast fuse, some scissors maybe, you know, it's endless, whatever you want to keep to hand. So, it's, they're fabulous. So, like I'm saying, these are wide enough for my stamps. Isn't that pretty paper? Love that. So, we're going to grab the trimmer again. I'm just going to do a little bit of measuring first. These boxes measure when closed, because we're going to be using the closure. This is six and a half inches. So I'm going to cut this down to three and a quarter. You know this thick bit, you can do it here. So line this up at three and a quarter. No, just uh, leaving your tab there because that's going to fold in. And that is going to give me a complete box in half. And then, oops, look at that, move it. And I'm going to just cut. I'm not going to try going back. But you've got it. You can snap it. How easy is that? Then you just make your boxes up as you would. Pop them into place. I always like to fold these flaps back. Let me just get that out of the way. Fold them back and then fold them forward, the flaps. Oops, she says. And to me, then, they just go in there really smoothly. And as you get those little flaps behind, oops, this one's popping out. Push them down flat inside, and there's your box. How cute. So let's make this other one up quick. I do like they're so sturdy there's no way you break these with fingers anyway pop these in push your flap down and that's how sturdy they are now I've got another one but because I've only limited to space on my block because uh, you basically you're just going to glue them together now with fast views they're fabulous absolutely fabulous i won't start my new board i'll save this one i need to order more acetate boxes see. so but you can also cut these oops there's my memory on you can cut them at an angle you know do a diagonal so it's easy to grab things from the front. You don't have to keep them perfectly straight. Um, but this is a fabulous way to get something so close. You're going to get loads of bits. Look at this memory and more pack that is coming out in the uh, celebration catalog. You can earn this for free. And you can get all of your sale, you can get everything in there, even the larger ones which are coming out. Oops. And these, I'm going to be using these in part of my project tomorrow. Look, memories of more packs, a whole shebang in one one of these uh, little trays. A whole pack of memories of more. And this is uh, this is going to be the sweet uh, the yeah the sweet soiree pack. It's in it's free and it's inside the. I love that. Where is it gone? It's free inside the celebration, so you can earn this for free. Love life, isn't that marvellous? But yeah, fits all inside there. 
everything on. That's just telling me what it is. But yeah, how fabulous. Great stuff. You can keep um, bits of designer series paper in here to hand. It won't do the six inches. Uh, pity, uh, because I'd have more on my desk then. But yeah, look, it's just marvellous. It's like, it's just, you know, so to put your teeth in. Right, you can either glue, which I don't recommend. I love my fast views. So you're just going to take your fast views and run it along the bottom. You can't see it. And also decide which one is going to be the back because this is the closure. Add some fast views. And basically, now just line that up against. Grab your bone folder. And press this down. And it's there. It's glued and you want to hold it. I don't know why you would hold it because uh, there's nothing um, stopping that from coming up. And it's, that's basically it. You just keep going until you've filled all your board. I could perhaps say get, get the way that's moulded less, it's hugging it. Um, I could probably get, say, another one, maybe two on there. I reckon two more maybe at a push. But look how sturdy it is. This one, for some reason, is coming away. Resolves that. Just in there, get some more flask views on it, and then just squeeze it back together. How perfect is that? Let me just do this last one. And because this is the back, I'm gonna ping that together. And there we have it. Last little box is going on here, lined up and raring to go. And it's big enough, you can, you can stash chocolate in this as well, <laughs> in case you want the munchies. <laughs> but uh, it holds your Tombow, you know, it holds other little bits of glue, um, uh, it's adhesive. It, not too wide, I wouldn't try and force the boxes open, but yes, um, no, that's too big, <laughs> that's way too big. <laughs> but uh, my two way glue pens they'd all stand up quite thick, they are as well. But my Wink of Stella's, you know, my other Wink of Stella, uh, I have these Versa Mark marker pens. You know, in case you want to emboss your signature, you can just literally draw. If you're good at drawing, then draw with Versamark, use your embossing powder and emboss it. Uh, but look, you can get all that in there. It's absolutely marvellous. Like I was saying, your scissors. Uh, your tweezers. You know, what a perfect little desk tidy so it's entirely up to you but uh, I'm sorry it was a quick one ladies tonight but uh, unexpected guests we weren't expecting the grandkids tonight we are just haven't, we haven't had them for four weeks bless because we've been poorly they've been poorly Christmas is coming up Ugh. so I hope you enjoy anyway and give it a go and I'm going to pop all my bits back in there but yeah, what a cracking thing. And let me just mind you, I will disturb. Um, and you can even use it if you just want to keep cards handy. You know, if you want to put together, you know, some cards and envelopes for occasions as well. Say you've got birthday cards, well, they're thank you cards. Because um, they hold five cards and it was catching on my ribbon. I won't force that one in. My ribbon sticker on the front of that one. Um, thinking of you cards, the ones I did the other night. Use it as a, um, a, t 
tidy to keep cards in even. The boxes were meant for cards, so they would hold a standard size card. Um, yeah, cards, everything. Perfect. So I hope you like it anyway, but that's my little desk tidy. Um, and I hope you give it a go. If you like, give it a thumbs up. If uh, you would like to share, that would be fantastic. And I will put it on the blog as well. Um, I'm saying um a lot and I can't, I don't like that. <laughs> it means I've got nothing to say and I have. I've normally got plenty to say. So, but thank you for watching. I'm sorry it's so uh, short-winded people, but I, you know me, I do promise to come on every single night. And I'm here. Yay. <laughs> but love you and leave you all. And uh, don't forget to press the subscribe button in the corner. And Happy New Year. Love you all. Bye.